Nah. I, I don't know. I, I've become I've become addicted to apple juice. Like, was it? Yesterday, I drank like two whole like cartons. I just I don't even know what I'm thinking. Finished it. Just calm. Nah. It's nice though. Nah. So nice. It's I, nice. One. I used to be more of an orange juice person, <clears> but now. Nah. Sure, it is. With orange juice, it's like thick. Not really. Apple juice just nah, tastes depends fake. What orange juice. There's some very nice orange juice. Apple like. juice just tastes fake. Apple fake. Juice fake. It just fake tastes fake. The only apple juice I like is the cloudy one. That means you're buying fake apple juice. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? The car one from Tesco. <laughs> no, but I think that orange juice is like you have time to sit down and drink this. Mm. Where apple juice you can drink and go. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. What's happening guys? Welcome to the Apex Podcast. Make sure you tap in. My name's Laura. My name's Jemima. And we have a guest with us today. His name is... Kenny. Yeah. So how's your week been? What's been happening? It's been calm, same old, same old really. Just... Year 13. Just laughing, yeah. yeah. Lockdown. Lockdown, exactly. Lockdown. Just at home. Yeah. Yeah. So we've got a couple of questions for you. Yeah, so um, we're, going, we are. we're going to... Yeah, some yeah. golden nuggets. Golden nuggets. Like, what's the... <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, so I have two categories for you to pick from. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait for this. So, okay, so we have. Okay, so. <laughs> so, in order to get the golden nuggets, um, you know, next to you. Oh, it's not next to you yet. Yeah. But if you win. If you get the majority of these questions right, then you can have golden nuggets. If you don't, then marmite. You, an, you see the marmite there. You got marmite. We promised you guys that we're going to come with a punishment, and we just couldn't take it anymore. First of all, the guests were getting them all right, so no one's even getting punished. And then second of all, the punishment just, just wasn't hitting right. So he's going to take a spoonful of marmite. Hopefully, he flops the question. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> so, okay, so you, have two, so you have two to pick from. You have K, variable K, where all the answers begin with K, or you have geography. Mm -hmm. I'll pick variable K. Okay, so first question, first question. What German word translates to children's garden but is used to describe school? <laughs> the K. Yeah. Kindergarten. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, cool. Oh, um, okay. What country is named after Africa's second highest mountain? <laughs> the face of me. <laughs> a country named after African second highest mountain. Yeah. Because of a K. Yeah. Isn't it like Kilimanjaro? Like, oh, is that one of the? No, nah, that's the mountain. Oh, the but that's country. not that's not the mountain we're talking about. Oh my, um, nah. You don't know it. Kenya. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's I didn't even know that. I was thinking that. I was like, oh right, is it actually a mountain? I don't know. That. Kilimanjaro is a Kilimanjaro is a mountain. Is the is the highest mountain? But then Kenya's I can't see. Oh wow. Oh. Alright, uh, cool. In this, okay, so that's two. So in this animated <laughs> film, the main character oh. Poe is voiced by Jack Black. The main character who? Poe is voiced by Jack Black. The main character Poe. Mm. Poe. So pass if you don't know. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> you it shut up. Okay. <laughs> what kind of wait? What did you say it was a movie? Yeah, it's an animated film. Animated film. Animated film, so it's like cartoon. It's an animated film. Thank you. Begins with a K. Five, uh, four, um, um, three, two, nah, one. Nah. Comfy Panda. Even I knew that one. Nah, I wouldn't have guessed that. You wouldn't have guessed that. But uh, you have a couple more tries anyway. Okay, no, you have like four more questions. Yeah. You really need this, you need this no. last question. Oh yeah, yeah. You need, you need no, you need three out of five. Yeah, and I've got two so far out of three. Mm. So I need one more. Come on. Okay, so question number four. What term is used for food that is fit for consumption? What, what term is used for food that's fit for consumption? That begins with a K? Yeah. Oh. 
No. Is set up? No. You did it? No, no, no. You did it. No. No, okay. It was Keisha. You didn't get that, Keisha. I don't know what that means. You see, like... No, it's okay. Amen. Google it. Oh. Okay, so last question. What? Okay. Oh, no, the album. The question is like, okay. Um. Okay. So the question is, you need this to get the nuggets. Okay. The album, Good Kid, Mad City. Who's it by? Kendrick Lamar. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, that was a, my that was a great effort. That was a great effort. White hands. No, I was really yeah. kind of Kenya. I was no. really kind of Kenya. I don't know how I got that. I don't know how I got that. What? Come on. Well, come on. That was the hardest questions yet. I can't lie. Yes. Thank you. All right, cool. You can have the nuggets. You can... That was. I wanted him to eat the marmite so bad. But. <laughs> so, because he won, um, we now have to do rock, paper, scissors to find out who has to do his forfeit. Um, are you ready? It's best out of three. Yeah, so we'll do rock, paper, scissors. Really. Is, is, is it rock, paper, scissors, shoot, or rock, paper, scissors? <laughs> you mean shoot, then do it, or sh on shoot? On shoot. Yeah, we'll do on shoot. Okay. I read it. I read it on it. I read it on it. Oh, okay. okay. I actually hate that. <clears throat> All right, go. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> Two out of three. Listen, Je Jemima. Jemima. Uh, white hand, can you just? White hand is gonna give Jemima um, this tasty, delicious treat. Um, Marmite and a spoon. Let's go. Come on, white hand. Mm. 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 Mm -mm. Thank you, God. <laughs> you, you knew. Kenny, it's, it's, it's a nice, happy, life, it's happy, it's happy. nice life. I even, I don't even know it. The whole spoon. No. Spoonful. Oh my god. Mm. I thought it was like jelly, but it's not. It's not. It's mm. not. Oh mm. my god. Even... <laughs> <laughs> if I had to eat that. Oh my god. <laughs> no. There's even draw. Look at it that. Draws. Draw. It draws. Draw. <laughs> There's draw. I can't mm. smell, so I don't know what it smells like. Can you guys give it? a little? I can't smell. There's no point. Oh, oh, okay. Just go for it. Just. I think you need a bigger spoon. Like, though. That's it's a bit like small. Maggie. It's a bit Broke small. with the berries. It smells like Maggie. Maggie. <laughs> it's not like if you were to eat. Look at the draw. Okay. Huh? Wait, oh. The whole. <laughs> eat it. Eat it. The whole thing. Mmm. <laughs> Delicious. Mm. That is so nice. If you need to be sick, because your nuggets are there. Yeah, that's a good point, you know. Kenny, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Why is it so salty? Why is it so salty? There's water. <laughs> My chest is paining me. <laughs> Imagine eating Marmite. <laughs> mm. Would have been me. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Jemima. 
know because <laughs> it's not even funny but it is though <laughs> and she um, uh, definitely not god forbid we're, we're changing the item every single time i don't care because uh, mom might yeah. <sighs> <But, laughs> <laughs> Do you know when she looked at me? I saw the pain in her eyes. <laughs> Alright, for this season, for this season, Mama, innit? That was. Oh. You tell Mama home as well. My tongue being violated. My tongue being violated. I'm sorry, but you're making me shake. Like, I, I was shaking. <sighs> okay. <clears throat> Okay, so... We're going to move on to, to get to know you. Yeah. We've got a couple of questions for Kenny. Now we're just going to, yeah. Mm. Okay, let's get to know you. What was the last message you sent? On my phone? Yeah. <laughs> Let me check. The last message I sent, uh, I told someone happy birthday. Uh, <laughs> oh, God, God, God. <laughs> that's a lie. Nah, the last message, look, the last message I sent, happy birthday, you said thank you. Oh, okay. <clears throat> okay, that's nice. Alright, next question. <laughs> what gives you the ick? What gives me the ick? What's that? That's when it's like, wait, what's the ick again? Like, you see when... It's like a little thing that, that annoys you. Where it like, when you're talking to someone or something, and then yeah. stuff, something you notice that they do. Oh. And then you're like, mm. You're like, I'm logging off now. Um. Can we get this away, please? <laughs> Somebody take this away. People that talk really loud. It was it? Like bear, like I don't know. Like, oh some yeah, it's like hey. sometimes it's just like especially when we're in public. Mm. Like people that just shout yeah. for no yeah, it's just Hello? Hello, <laughs> can you hear me? <laughs> On the yeah. bus. Yeah. Nah, I hate those people, yeah. Alright, valid. Okay, so what would be in your starter pack? Starter pack of what? You. You. Like Oh Chatsy, was... Chatsy, Chatsy, Chatsy. Mm-hmm. Chatsy, that's I don't it. Think... If I could only own one I would Tuck not have clothing. shoes, I would not have a phone, just have a bunch of Chatsy. Wow. Matching or you just... Wow. I don't even... Just, it's the comfortability. It's not really mm. the... It's just there's no, yeah, there's no better feeling. What else though? Because it's got to be like three, four things. Yeah, you might like make up Kenny. Um, like, when people think of Kenny, they're like... If you were to put Kenny in a box, like, what mm. would you put? Definitely. Definitely tracksuit's the main one. Um, <clears throat> Kenny, Kenny, what else? Start up. Like, I don't even know. Everything else. <laughs> what else? What else? What, what's your start up? Like? What was... I need to know how I do. Mom might. Can you try it? Stop. Um, I don't know. I haven't thought about that. <laughs> oh, 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 wait, wait, I'm asking. Asking. <laughs> 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 I've only put like, I don't know, Netflix. I've only mm. put Netflix there. TV oh, yeah. in general. Mm-hmm. Um, food. What's food? food. Nigerian food. I put a gel off in there. <laughs> just trying to ski for Jenna Fuller. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> oh, I'm going to get out of this. All right, cool. So, apple juice. Apple juice? Nah. I, I don't know. I, I've, become, I've become addicted to apple juice. Like, what was it? Yesterday, I drank like two whole like, cartons. I just, I don't even know what I was thinking. Just finished it. Just calm. Nah. It's nice though. Nah. So nice. That's I, nice I used to be more of an orange juice person, <clears throat> but now. Sure, it is. With orange juice, it's like thick. Not really. Apple juice just nah, tastes fake. Orange juice. There's some very nice orange juice. Apple like. juice just tastes fake. Apple fake? juice fake. It just fake tastes fake. The only apple juice I like is the cloudy one. That means you're buying fake apple juice. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you mean? The cotton one from Tesco. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I think that orange juice is like you have time to sit down and drink this. Mm. Whereas apple juice, you can drink and go. Yeah. Fact. Yeah. <laughs> Like, I feel like orange juice will get stuck it's in your esophagus. Like same orange juice, I don't orange, understand. No, orange juice is like you drink it with breakfast, like you're sat down. You're, For real. Like apple juice is just quick. Bounce. Yeah. Exactly. You drink it on the go and everything. Oh, you can't drink orange juice on the go. That'd That's be weird. <laughs> That'd just be weird. Fact. If you had won 5,000 drops into your account anonymously. 5,000? Yeah, 5k. Pounds. What would I do with it? Yeah, what are you doing? I'm not even a spender like that. I think I'll buy a laptop or something. Mm. I'm a, yeah, I'll buy a, um, what's them laptops, the Mac, 
Mac, I'm, I'm, no, Mac. Macbook. Macbook. I'll buy a Macbook. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'll buy a Macbook. <clears throat> and the rest and savings or? Yeah, yeah, I'll just save the rest. I'm not really a spender like that. I don't want to spend much. Wow. What's that like? I don't... Not being a spender. Because <laughs> I spend. It's crazy. It's difficult. Shambolic. <laughs> like, every time I pa- pass a card, I'm just shake my head. <laughs> <laughs> like... Just this so week, sad. I ordered so much stuff this week, yeah. She'll be like, do you mind what you order? I'm like, I really don't remember. Yeah, I don't remember. It just comes, and you're just like, yeah. I mean, actually, I'll, I don't know how much full part, you know the, like, to get first, if you want, I just want to go on all the rides, but I don't want to wait in line. Oh, fact. Oh, the first yeah. track, the, yeah. the first track. I need that I like stuff. That. When Corinne is done, innit? Yeah. It's so sad, because whenever you go to full part, you, like, you go there thinking, oh, I'm going to go on this and this. Free max. Yeah. Free max. That's how when me and my friend we went, yeah, but we stayed at over. So oh yeah, yeah. Not in the hotel. That hotel was sick, overpriced. Like it's literally a bunk. You're paying like two hundred for like a bunk bedroom. Oof. It's the audacity for me because like <laughs> that's so rude. But we went to a hotel and mm. then we came back and we it was like a hundred pounds. It was calm. Was it? And we got to go on like almost everything. Every single one. Literally. I've never even been to Fort Worth. You never been? Not once. It's alright. It's all right. Uh, last one. It's the last one. I believe so, yeah. 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 All right, come on. Blank is toxic. What do you think is toxic? I was having this comment. What does toxic actually mean? Like, something that, yeah, something that you think <laughs> is too, something that is normal, that's like, nah, this is weird. Or like, this is, this needs to stop. What do you get? Up. Blank is toxic. <clears throat> Wait, give some examples of toxic stuff. Like before, we've we've had um, comparison. Yeah. Um, we've had like unforgiveness, stuff like mm. that. Okay, okay, I got. One. Did I just say it. Yeah. yeah. I would say um, dishonesty, like not being honest. Mm. Like um, lying. Yeah, that's a fair point. So on. <clears throat> All right, so we're going to move on to Waffle of the Week, where we just waffle. Um, <laughs> so um, i got a question for you guys. And um, go into depth if you, if you can. But my question is, if you had a movie made about your life, one, what would it be called? And two, what would the genre be? Oh. Mm. <laughs> I hope you actually movie this thing. Cool. It'll be cool. Action. I don't even know what it'll be action movie, yeah. <clears throat> Why? They'll have like big like explosions. Like obviously explosions aren't happening in my life, but <laughs> in the movie there'll be explosion scenes and stuff. Like if you want to exaggerate stuff, yeah. that'll be funny. What would it be called? Uh, let's think. Go for it. No, I don't know why the name Fast and Furious came into my head. <laughs> I'm already taking it. My life is not Fast and Furious. <laughs> Actually, sometimes, but not really. I'm a new straw. Can I have a new straw, please? Can I have a new straw, Wait, what happened? I can taste it on the straw. <laughs> <laughs> don't be so real. <laughs> I, I just love it. <laughs> The downstairs. Alright, it's cool. Do you actually do you want me to go get a new one? I can go get one. No, it's cool. Are you sure? No, no, stay. It's okay. (laughs) Alright. Yeah. So what would it? (laughs) (laughs) Do you know what killed me though? Is the drag. Like as soon as I saw the draw, yeah, I knew it was gonna be so real for her. You can't have been watching Jamara the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I've been, I've been looking at her. <laughs> and she looks like she's over it. She's like, ep- the episode just started, mate. Do you know what I mean? Um, Bitch. Oh my God. <laughs> so, um, what would you call your, yeah, your life movie? What would it be called? Yeah. I think it would be basic, like, Life of, like, you know, like Life of Pi? Mm. But it would just be Life of Kenny. Nice. Because it's like, it's unique. So even if there's another Kenny, there's like a specific Kenny that life. The like, Life of Kenny. Serious. Okay. Serious. Mm. What about you, Jamama? Um, it would be like a thriller. 
But like, you know them, but not like a killing one. You <laughs> see the one where you think and then it's like... But like a psychological... Yeah. yeah. That's how I do it. And <clears> then, <throat> I don't know what it'd be called though. Yeah. Mom, I... I'm changing... <laughs> 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 I'm changing my category. I think it'll be a detective... You know, like detective movies, like mm-hmm. police films. Yeah, it'll be like that. Oh, cool. It'll be like that. Mm. Yeah. I don't know. Mine would just be... What genre can I even do for this? See, um, um, I don't even know. I'm thinking of comedy, but not not really though. I feel like yours would be comedy. I think it would just be silly comedy though, like one of them parody movies. Oh yeah. Mm. And I don't know title. Parody. Let's go with something simple and basic. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we're moving on to the big topics and today we're talking about romantic relationships because it's February and Valentine obviously is Valentine is coming. <laughs> yes. So, um, we've got a couple of questions for you and yeah, we're just going to discuss. Um, so first question is how significant do you think Valentine's is? But how important would you say? What today? Yeah, Valentine's Day. Um, I don't know, I'm thinking, like, I mean, it's only really important if you're in a relationship. Mm, fair point. Do you think even in a relationship is that significant, right? I think, personally, um, It's discussion. It is, it's, 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 it's significant, yeah, it's significant, but it's only significant because it's been made significant. Like, really and truly, it's just, it's just, just a day. day. But... Because it's a thing, you can't be the one person to be like, nah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Now I get you. I would say, like, yeah, the same. It's been made significant, so. I know, and people just run with it, so. So now if you don't, then yeah, you're the. Yeah. Facts, facts. So, um, second question is what are the qualities you look for in a partner? Oh. Um. Like they have to have gone through a bit of struggle. Huh? They have to have gone through a bit of struggle. Because <laughs> the mama is okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're terrible. You're, You're terrible. Okay. You're, You're terrible. Okay. I feel like, nah. Because I feel like some people's had, like, their lives are too easy. They're like, oh, they you want long suffering? <laughs> yeah, long suffering. <laughs> I'm saying, I feel like, I'm not saying like, died or something like that. I'm not saying like that. I'm just saying, like, I don't know. They just have to be understanding. Some people are not. Oh, understand. struggle. Yeah. Okay, cool. Anything else you want to add? Oh, no. Yeah. When it comes to me, innit? Hmm? When it comes. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> you, me, I say, like, it's kind of sitting there. It's sitting there. You think it's it's okay. <laughs> Kenny, what's yours? Mm. What's, like, your in- initial um, instinct of, like, what qualities you look for? Initial instinct? Probably one is, like, laid, not, like, laid back, like, not too emotional and, like, Cause me, I'm more but chill. Yeah, yeah, and I'm not too. I try to be more emotional if I was like, but I'm not really too in touch with. So someone that's my emotional yeah, side, yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> someone that's someone that's a bit, someone that's a bit, someone that's a bit calm like that. Um, what else? I think someone that prays like prays like aggressively, like you know them people that mm-hmm. like, pray aggressively, pray, like, as in they in spend the, like hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Someone that says hours, like that's good. Yeah, yeah. That's good. Yeah, that's that's proper. Because if you have someone like that, then me, yeah. I'll still do my praying, but they've got me. So yeah, <laughs> they've, they've, they've got me. Like, they've got me. Covered. They've got me covered. They got me covered. Yeah, covered. it covers you nicely. Yeah. So when you're lacking one day, they're just yeah. you know the whole house is sealed. Exactly. Like, do you know what I mean? Yeah. I get you. I think funny is a, a, another one. Goofy, because I think that like yeah, you just got to be goofy because otherwise it's boring. Mm. For you. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. I'm goofy, so. I feel like, in general, even if they're not, even if other people don't really see them as funny, you guys yeah. have the inside jokes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, yeah, facts, facts. Um, yeah, so talking stage, obviously that's the thing. Talking stage. Um, how do you think it has changed from before to now? Any of you can go. Before, as in like nineteen hundreds mm, and stuff. Mm, mm. Did they even have talking stages? 
Courting, isn't it? Courting. Oh, like, oh, you see, we watch Bridgerton. Them lot got married, like. Yeah. I watch a stupid show. Yeah, and all that. Wait, what? They're all that courting. You see, like, in, like them old movies. Yeah. Like, it's about mm. courting. And, I've got 10 yeah. tutors. You know what yeah. I mean? We've got to see them at the ton. Like that. The ton. <laughs> What's going on here? Man? What's going on here? You got too much into the series, didn't you? Yeah. Started to envision yourself in the series. Stop! Please stop! Am I lying? Please stop! Please stop! You please and Mama stop. in, in, in the series. Nah, but like, I don't know. I just like that time for like court, and I feel like it was more effort from both of them. Mm, okay. Then, Do you think it was like positive though? Because a lot of, cause I don't know, like, obviously there's always good and bad in everything, really and truly. Because like back then, obviously, it's a bit more like, it's a lot more like monitored. Because you know, like, their mums and dads will be involved and stuff like that. So it's like, yeah, you had to put in the effort because you know people are watching. But I don't even think that's a bad... Do you think that's a bad thing? Like, I don't think it's a bad thing, but I'm saying that sometimes involved. it's like pressure. Oh, you think that's calm? I think that's weird. You why think that's they, weird? Why are your parents going to be involved? No, but like, <laughs> I don't... Not, well, I feel like they should be involved to an extent. Not like... Yeah, yeah, not in a... In a talking stage? No, not yeah, in the talking stage. As in, I'm just getting <laughs> like, to know you. Like, when what you guys are getting to know each other, like, I wouldn't be saying... Okay, I wouldn't mind, yeah, if my parents, they were like, oh... Da, da, da. What's his name? Not even like that. Like, if they said, oh, okay, this guy, um, he wants to get to know you, da, da, da. do you want to get to know him? I wouldn't mind that. Nah, I think that's... Mm -hmm. I would just be awkward, like, when I see my mum, she'll be like, how's... I'll be like... Oh. Obviously, they're not going to be in the relationship. Like, they will be, though. Not, okay, they will. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing it, she'll definitely be. <laughs> but, like, do you think it's more like pressure, though? Because back then, you had... And, like, obviously, back then, it was like... Not everyone, obviously, but... It's a bit more arranged. Mm. So there's a lot more pressure than that. I think it's like a different kind of pressure. Like there's still, I think talking stage is always going to be pressure, but it's just different pressure now. Yeah. Like the pressure. How, how would you say the, the no. pressure's changed then? Because before it was pressure to like, if your parents was pressuring you, it'd be like to show respect to the person. Mm -hmm. Nowadays, people are, it's people around the like, talking stage is now just, you Waffle. treat, you, yeah, you treat, you're treating them like they're your girl or your wife, but. But you have no intention. Yeah, you have no. It's that, it's that. It's, it's, it's literally a go with the flow. Yeah, that, exactly. You go with the... Yeah. Go with the flow. But where's the flow going? There's, that, there's actually no destination. There's no that's destination. the thing. There's no destination. <laughs> um, and they don't tell you that, you know. In the talking stage, they don't tell you that it's going nowhere. Oh. Until it's... <laughs> it's true. They don't tell you that it's going it's nowhere. It's true. But, like, you just have to read the signs and yeah. be like, is this person serious or not? <laughs> But yeah. <laughs> Stop oh. looking at me. <laughs> my my. <laughs> so overall, yeah. you get out. Overall, <laughs> would you say it's positive or negative? Like the change. Negative, negative, negative. It's a negative, negative. It's not good. Talking stages are. People don't under. I don't think. I think it's. Just, I think just the name talking stage. People think like you're. You're not in a relationship. Yeah, yeah people put too much pressure. Yes. Yeah, you think? Yeah, people put too much pressure on talking stage. Do you think it's like one one person putting the pressure on another person to be serious when that person isn't serious and that makes it a bit... Or do you think it's just in general like... What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> um, I haven't heard you talk. <laughs> so sorry. Um, what, do you, what do you mean like the question I just asked or do, like positive or, or negative? Yeah, uh, both. Yeah, cool. Um, I don't know. I think it's like, I feel like it's slightly on the negative side. I wouldn't say that it's like extreme negative, but I think I think before it's more like community raises a child kind of thing. So everyone's in your business, like they know that you're like you're caught in. So therefore, everyone's kind of, you know, like monitoring you in a way. So you kind of have to act, even if you didn't want to. You have to act a little bit, like you know, for, for the most part. Obviously, not everyone. Um, but I think now. It's very individualistic. Yeah. So private. it's about your intention. So if your intention is to end up being married or not, then I suppose that's where it's going to go. If your intention is just go with the flow, then you go with the flow. So I don't know. It's a bit, yeah. I would say it's a little bit more negative than it. But yeah, that's what I think. Next question? Yeah, sure. Cool. Um, how much is the phrase beauty is in the eye of the beholder based on nurture? So like your environment, and is that a good thing? Oh. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, yeah. a lot, yeah. yeah you you say? How so? Yeah. <laughs> I know, but like, for example, like, somebody, somebody grew up in a very specific 
cultural background and they're surrounded they're piece, surrounded by the piece. same people mm. that's mm. what they grew up with they're more likely to marry or to be attracted to people who they grew up with if you know mm. what i mean then if like somebody they were supposed to go like outside of their culture it would be like they're less likely mm -hmm. you know what i mean well, that's what yeah. that's what i think <laughs> no i see um but in secondary school i went to a boys school so we're just like i was just around about and then what was it how was that though going to boys school yeah oh, i'm always fun. like do you know what it's i don't know like it's always taboo not taboo but it's like you went to all oh, just like my yeah, family. people say that, it, but it was, I think it was funny. It was good. It was a good time. Like, I don't know. It was funny. It was so <laughs> everyone there was just a joke. That like, whole thing was just a joke. Mm -hmm. But um, so now when when there was like girls, sometimes like I'll look back and see them now, and I'm like, but it's because I was surrounded by boys, so it's like beauty changed because it was like I didn't see. It's like a lot of people say when I was just going into sixth form, mm. when um when the olders was giving me advice and stuff, it was like you see a new type of like. The, the, the what's the word I'm looking for? It's like the type of people you see has changed. Like it's a new, you're in a new thing. So it's like as you grow older, but it's not even as you're older because it's nurture. It's like as you get put in different situations, yeah. but it just happens to be that you're getting older as it's happening. Mm -hmm. But as you get put in different situations, beauty will change in your eye. Yeah, because there's some people that I thought was beautiful in year seven that I'm now you're around. just like ah. Yeah, because I feel like you, you get to um, know yourself a lot more. 100, 100, 100. Yeah, 100. You become like more of an individual. So like your idea of what's actually pretty and not what everyone else says. Because a lot of time you just go with what everyone else says. Yeah, like... Or like what's current at the time. Yeah, yeah. like media says some that's look like this, 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 and that's the girl that you need to yeah. like. Or that's who you need to be going for. But it's um, so funny because like when everyone grows up, you then see who everyone gets with and you're just like... Weren't you the one that screaming one. that they have to have this and this that they have and to suddenly, be six foot the... yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he's shorter than you. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was rude. That was rude. That went over my head nah, for a nah. second. Um, yeah. So I think you get to know yourself a lot more. Um, you get to pick what you actually want. Although I'm not gonna lie, you still have influences. Like I think it would be a bit silly to say that like everything you pick in life is just what you want. Because you still get influenced by what is considered pretty or beautiful or yeah, a beauty. Um, you might just stray off off of it for a little bit. You might go completely like extreme, but I think that you always know what society thinks is pretty, and you might tailor it to that. I think. Yeah. But yeah, yeah like when people are like oh I like ugly pen boys like huh? what is that? You see when people are like oh I like ugly ugly boys. Ugly boys. Yeah. But like they're like ugly, but they're not. They know that society thinks. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like the, they're not yeah. the norm. Or yeah, like yeah, they're yeah. not the they're not the what's that standard? Term? Yeah, they're not they're not like that. But they're not actually ugly. But it's just that it's just yeah, like it's society ugly. views them as ugly. Yeah, that's how me some friend of mine because nobody's ugly. Facts. Thanks. Any any final sort of ideas on that? No. What was the what was the question? Um, is the is the phrase beauty is in the eye of the beholder based on nurture? Oh no, no, that's a good and is there a, is that a good thing? I feel like every I feel like a lot more, the majority of things in life are based on nurture. Like I don't, mm. yeah, the majority of, like what in life is just 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 yeah, yeah. nature. Yeah. yeah, and I feel like as you're growing up, yeah, you don't know what you want. Like you think you know what you want. Like you think I want this, but then there's certain things you'd be like, oh, you wouldn't know that that that's the person, that's not the person for you, if you know what I mean, mm -hmm. if you haven't been in that situation. Yeah. If you know what I mean, like, I'm trying to think of an example. Um, While you're thinking though, I also think that, um, what's it called? I was gonna say um, that um, sometimes you can kind of, and I think that's also why um, a lot of people say, personally overlooks like when, as they grow older, because they get to know that like, even though obviously someone looks a certain way that it's deemed as beauty, it's not really gonna stick. Mm. So I think that's, that's the more individual part of it as well. I think that you get to know who you click with. So then you kind of just, yeah. mm. you go from there. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then like what I was saying is like, so yeah, you said you want a girl who prays. It's like, if I'd asked you that in year seven, you yeah. wouldn't know. You wouldn't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's, it's that certain situation that as your faith has grown, you know that you need somebody whose mm -hmm. faith is like up there as well. Do you get? 
So you don't know what you want. Mm. That's why yeah. it's like the personality thing. Yeah, yeah. Because like the older you get, the more you'll meet good-looking girls that, I mean, good-looking people that's, that's personality is not. not yeah, just not it. Then you realize. Looks is, looks is not everything. Yeah, and sometimes mm. it's not even that their personality is bad, it's just that you just don't... Yeah, you don't... This doesn't make sense. You don't yeah. mesh. Yeah, you don't mesh. And that's not a bad thing. That's just what it is. Um, so, moving on to D's and Q's, which is dilemmas and questions. So, I got one. Very interesting one. Um, this says, should you be giving relationship advice if you're single? No. <laughs> no. No, you should not. No, is it? you should not. <laughs> I do think that people that are not in a relationship, in fact, no, no cool. You if can't you've been in a that. relationship, you can't cool, say cool. That. Let me see. Because that's what I was saying. Because otherwise, we'd all be single here. Do you know but I don't mean? know if you're single. Wait, have you been in a relationship before? No. And you're given relationship? Every day, <laughs> man. Every day. Advice. I don't know. I feel like, no, no, but it's I feel to, like, no, 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 I don't, honestly, no. if I'm being completely honest, I don't think, if you've never been in a relationship, I don't think you should be given a relationship. You can say, you can give your perspective. Yeah, you can give your perspective, but you have to. Preface it like, cool, I've never been in a relationship, but this is what I think. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because being in one is different from... Yeah, but I feel learning. like... But then... Oh yeah, no, you can go. You can go. No, but I feel like an outside looking in as well. Like You might yeah. see a relationship is toxic and it might be, but the people in it, they can't see because yeah. they're all like... I suppose that is perspective as well. But yeah, yeah, the, but that's what... Yeah, I was going to go along those lines as well. Like, I think that obviously it's, it's a hard one because... You, like that's a perspective thing though because mm. when you're in when you've been in a relationship you have a different perspective yeah, yeah, and you I kind know. of like understand things from that point of view i think that also like you said on like the outside looking in you can look at a situation and be like yeah something's not right here yeah. and then maybe someone that's been in a relationship is like no nah, that's actually okay mm. so i think that like it depends i, I just think that you you've got to be like it, you've got to go to the right person i think you, you just can't go to any any silly pe people They've got to be like wise in a way. But then there's silly people who have been in relationships. They're not giving, they should be giving advice. That's yeah, very true. That's very true. Yeah, I changed my mind. I think anyone should be so able to no, give advice no. to anyone. Yeah, anyone should be able to give it. <laughs> yeah. But it's just you pick. Pick the right people. Yeah, because you could pick yeah. the wrong person in a relationship or the wrong person out of a relationship. It's still going to be bad advice. True. Exactly, true. exactly. So yeah, that's fine. That's an interesting one. <laughs> yeah, that hit me. Especially when you said no, I was like, go No, I, just, I was thinking Chava, that. Uh, <laughs> No, nah, because there's some people that will give a relationship advice, but they, they actually no don't know any. If you, yeah. Say you yeah, know yeah. a lot of people in relationships, you've seen a lot, mm -hmm. so you're like wise to it, then fair enough. But there's some people that just, I don't they're even know where talking. they get their ideas from. Yeah, like, yeah, and you're thinking. Like, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? <laughs> this is not it. You got any? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, these and keys, yeah. Um, <laughs> she says, yeah. The mom might went to her brain. Oh, <laughs> to her brain. Go on. You're gonna drag this mom, I think. Hold on, let me fill up my D's and Q's. All right. Because <laughs> I've been shaking for a very, very long time because that mom is I'm shaking because shaking it's cold. I'm literally shaking because it's cold. Yeah, no, like, it's kind of cold. It's freezing. Yeah, a tracksuit. You have two tracksuits on. <laughs> <laughs> It's cold outside. 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 Oh, man, it's cold outside. It's so cold. Wait. Oh, no, I can see it. You didn't see it. I thought that was just the inside of the thing. No, no, no. No, it has a whole zip. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. Are you into each other's own? Outside is cold. Outside is cold. I knew, like, guys from the school that would have, obviously, their boxes on, obviously, and then they have shorts. And then they have a tracksuit, and then they bring in their like school trousers. Yeah, I do, I do that too, but only in the winter though, not the summer. Yeah. What they wear tracksuit underneath their school trousers? Oh. Do you go to a mid school now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. All right. So then, when I got here, was like, my friend is in a relationship, and her parents need to know. Like, should I tell? <laughs> like, she's in a very serious relationship, and. Her parents like don't know. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, we're single. Do you think, we can't do you give think, you advice. Do you, think, <laughs> do you think? When do you say like? When do you think? Okay, I'm trying to rephrase it. When do you think, like, your parents should get involved? Basically, why are you laughing? Oh, oh, oh. oh what? At what point they should like meet? Yeah. Like, ooh. Ta -ta -ta. This is so hard because I like, I, I, I like. I've heard this question before. And like, whenever I hear it, it's always a mixed bag. Like, it's always like, oh, like, one person would be like, oh, like three weeks in, 
one person be like, oh, a couple months down the line. One person be like, when well, it feels right. So I don't, like, I, it depends on the question. I mean, not, um, it depends on the situation, I mean, I think. I, I think, my, my, sorry, my, my question to her is like, what is holding it back? That's what I was going to say as well. Um, yeah, what's, like, what's the, like, what's the worst case scenario? Like, if the parents see them, what's going to, mm. unless there's a big reason then, it doesn't really matter. He wears free tracksuits at the yeah. time and not have it. Nah, it's true, it's true, it's true. If I was to go meet some of the parents, I wouldn't wear I'll just, I, I don't think I'll wear tracksuits. With suit and tie? Not the first time. No, nah, not suit and tie, that's a drag. That's a drag. Maybe like a t-shirt or something, but. T-shirt. Or a white shirt. But, um, there's something I was going to say. It's also like, if you say you want to marry the person, mm -hmm. then they're going to have to meet your parents eventually. Yeah. Exactly. <gasps> oh, like, you know, you know movies and stuff, yeah, when they like, they just propose. That can never be me. Yeah. Like, he's like, oh my God, it was a surprise. And I didn't know, like, that can never be me. I feel like you have to ask my parents. Yeah. For permission yeah. for marriage. You can't just propose to me. Because that, yeah. That's kind of rude. Yeah, but what if your parents said no? Or if you really, you like, this, you love this guy. And, and you ask your mum and she said no. Your mum's going like, to be like, what kind of love is this? <laughs> I don't like the deep, guy. You were that's deep in love. You were deep in love. Ah, uh, that's right. Um... I honestly, I don't know. I don't know. It's hard. It's hard. But I wouldn't want them to ask without asking them. You think? Like, what? Would you just say yes? Yeah, but if you're deep in love. <laughs> like, and you just throw it to this me. I would actually be like, like right? I'll say yes, but I'd be like, have you asked them? And you say no, I'll actually give the ring back. What would you do if, if you ask your girlfriend, well, yeah, girlfriend, if she wants to marry you and she said no? Is the whole thing locked up? Well, like, well, she said, like, she's not First, ready. Yes, the whole thing is locked up. Oh, is it? Well, the because, whole relationship is done. Maybe. I need to work. No, no, to be fair. I need to work on. I need to. That's. I need to work on my pride now. But it will hurt. My heart. Oh. Your heart will hurt. It depends. Yeah. Yeah. Like, if we're inside, we're, if we're by ourselves, mm -hmm. I'll. I'll definitely take a break. Maybe like a two weeks. I'll just be, you do it. I'll be what doing some soul <laughs> yeah, I'll just be thinking. I'll just, I just need to think. But if you it's in public. Break. Nah, if it's in public. <laughs> it's in public. <laughs> don't I'll, I'll rather like, you say yes. Yeah. Like, I'd rather food. you say yes and then tell me in private. Nah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I would never embarrass you no, in, nah, in public. I'll never embarrass you. And I'll, I'll never speak to you. It's not even that the marriage is up. I'm never speaking to you again. I'm going to block you on everything. Oh my God. You'll never talk ever. The amount of salt coming from this side of the room is the same salt that was in that marmite. Can you stop with this Marmite? <laughs> that is crazy. This Marmite. Never again. I'm going to lace your yeah. nuggets with Marmite next time. <laughs> <laughs> you know the taste. You know mm, the taste. Mm, 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 mm. Gosh. That's not. But, I mean, yeah, your pride. Yeah, I need to work on it though. I do need to work on it. Yeah. Oh, and it's good, you know. Like, I feel like a lot of people didn't realise that you actually need to work on yourself before you get into a relationship. Yeah, facts. Yeah. Definitely. What do you guys think is probably like the best way to work on yourself though? The best way or what? Working on yourself. Mm -hmm. Just in terms of like character and... The Bible. Because I personally think it's just... Oh, what'd you say? The Bible. The, oh, the Bible. The Bible. <laughs> yeah, Bible, yeah. Thanks. Getting to know God, close to God. Yeah. I think then you get to know yourself because I think that then you, he reveals things about yourself that you didn't know. And the thing is, there's certain stuff that you'll see yourself doing certain, like, it's not even that you've tried to change, but you've just started changing. Mm -hmm. It's also, um, it's like, for example, in, uh, like, a year ago, I started hanging around some, like, more serious people. Mm -hmm. Then all of a sudden, it wasn't like I changed anything, but I just got more serious because yeah. I was, so it's like, that's good. If you hang around serious people that read the Bible, then you win. Yeah, yeah. and I think, so, um, as a Christian, I think you're always sort of striving to stay... Not like in line where it's like, oh, like you can't do anything wrong or you like you can't. I mean, obviously, it's I think to sin, but um, but I think that you're always sort of um, checking yourself to try and see if you're kind of steering too far out of the realm mm -hmm. of obviously what you believe. So I think that also helps when you're getting closer to God, because then you're always checking yourself. So then when yeah, it comes like to like, subconscious, yeah. Subconscious. So when it comes to like like certain characteristics that you have, like behavioural then you're kind of checking yourself like, oh, is this, is this something that makes sense? Or am I just, yeah, do I, have to, do I need to work on my pride or? Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. And so. like, I feel like when, 
Like, a lot of people are looking for a relationship, like, these days. Like, they're looking for, like, scouring. Scouring. Yeah. On all social medias, they're searching for, like, boyfriend and girlfriend or whatever. And it's... And it's not... I feel like that's not how it's supposed to feel. I feel like the right person will come to you. I feel mm -hmm. like it's not... Like, people it. get... People get, like, all these apps and stuff just to find... Just to find boyfriend and girlfriend. I feel like that shouldn't be like that. It should be natural. Mm. Which is why I hate talking stage on Snapchat and da da da. da. It's the worst. Definitely. It's the worst. Why are you saving the why are you saving the chat? Oh <laughs> like, I hate when people it? ask me that. What do you mean why am I saving the chat? It's the two way street. I'm so I can save the I'm, chat if I want to save I'm the chat. So, I'm so forgetful. <laughs> but like it's like you're saving every message. Every message, man. Oh, no, you're terrible. <laughs> Because you're so like, that's a red flag for me. I can't lie to you. <laughs> red flag. That's the Listen, red flag for me. I don't know. I don't know. The thing is, yeah. If I'm if if I'm talking to anyone, it's because like I know you. So yeah. Like, what's, what's, what's the issue? Here? Yeah, like I feel like people try and force talking stage with like people they don't know. Mm. Like randoms, like they'll be like, oh, like I don't know. You see when you shout to other people out for their birthday, mm. and he, I like, saw you on someone's snap, and, and like. I yeah. like the way you do it. And then just message you and they're like, <laughs> You like the way you do it? I like the way you do it. So I went over so my head. So I decided to add you. Yeah. Nah, Nothing. it's long. It's long. I like to say it talks to me. I don't, <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this. I'd rather meet you in, the, in a real life. In a real life. Yeah. What about you? Do you think so? About it's best to do real life or? 100%, 100%, 100%. Oh, cool. Any more D's and Q's? No, I don't have any more. I don't have any more. So we'll just wrap it up. Okay, so that's it for today's episode of TAP. Make sure to join us on Sundays for church at these times on the screen. Also, join us for Apex on Fridays on Zoom, which the dates for older and youngers are going to be on the screen. And also join us for Focus, which is our Bible study for youngers and olders. And the dates will also be on the screen. Yeah. Make sure that you send in your D's and Q's for next time. It's going to be all about personality, personality. Um, getting to know yourself, which is quite nice because it ties into to this. So it's almost like a follow on from that. Continuation. Exactly. Yeah. Um, and yeah, add us on Snapchat, add us on Instagram. They will be also on the screen. And yeah, tapping out. Thanks, guys. <laughs>